be me. Running a Gorkamorka solo game with Splack, the creator of Constable and the dwarf assassin who found Jesus. Introduced Splack to 40k, instantly fell in love with the orcs, even more cranked when he learned they had their own game. Doesn't want a party of orcs, wants a singular dipstick. Insists on being a diggernob which is pretty much a human cosplaying as an orc. Nothing to his name but a shooter, a leather vest, and a baseball cap with the word orc painted on. Named him Fud. My face when. Roll with it. Give the idiot three wounds so that he lasts more than five seconds. Refuses to break character. As DM I must retain my dignity and rise to these standards. Sound like a couple of autists. Having a blast though. Was in a digger clan. Got booted out fair not been chop enough. He's real shooty though. So dear Sumi is muckin' bout out to Domek town. Ain't allowed in cussy ain't orc enough. Says Zog dat and goes in anyway. Tells die guard boy tar go swallow a grot and runs into our nearest bar. Guard is a true orc. Can't aim for Zog. Kicks da doors open. What he wanted. What he got. All da lads turn and stare at him. One big one in the corner asks what's a grot like I'm going in da bar. Oh oh you call in a grot. Yes not big and don't like that. Gets right down in thud's face. Oh I called ya a grot. What they a gun do bout it thud tries da crump his face. Thud hits like a grot. Big and crumps I'm back and it hurts. Voice in da back oh is ed says ta use da shooter. Thud ain't giving up. Crumps him again. Still hits like a grot. Gets crumped again by da big and. Almost zogged I'm. Ears a bootiful voice in his head. Quit mucking about and give I'm da daka. Thud jumps back and pulls out his shooter. Blasts da big and right and da ed. Big and ain't got to ed no more. Thud looks at da resto da boys. Boys are looking at I'm funny. Thud loots da big and. Gets some teeth and a nice little chopper. Goes up to da bar. Orders around fair da boys with da teeth. Boys cheer. E alright fair a lil jit. Leds da boys in a chorus of da orc classic. There we go. They only know da first line but that's alright. Drinking with da boys. Avian a good time muckin' bout. Den da boys all get quiet like. Turns around. Big knob is in da doorway. Looks at da dead jit. Asks real calm which jit zog is begun. Thud hops off his seat and says he did it. Knob asks why he did a fain like that. Cause he called me a grot. Nob stomps over and looks down at I'm. Thud looking em right in the eye. Nob laughs and slaps I'm on da shoulder. Knocks it out of place. Oh I like dis lil jit he's got guts thud chuckles as he loses feeling in his arm. Nob stops loin and looks at I'm again. Yow's better be as tough as he was or oh I'm gonna see how many guts ya got. Thud nods. You got it boss. Gets a pat on da the arm. Puts it out too. And that's how Thud met his boss and almost died during his first interaction with orcs. If you lads want more of this idiot just say so. We've been doing it for months now and every session has been more or less a beautiful mess. Would chain them all together and link them with the epic tag so you can tell them apart from my usual one-offs. Be me. DM mine another round of Gorkamorka. Thud nearly killed himself within 10 minutes of his first session by trying to have a fist fight with a biggin. Realize that he has about a 1 out of 20 chance of wounding a regular unarmed orc in a round of CQC. Orc has 2 1 out of 3 chances to wound him at minimum. Decided that being choppy isn't really his thing still keeps his chopper. Erion needs a chopper. At da bar with da boys. Nob comes in. Says he's got some umis out and da skid that need crumpin cuss day on his turf. Thud and da boys all get loaded up and ready fair some kalin. Got da knob. Four choppy lads. Four shooters. And thud. Arabadi loads up in da knob's truck and set out for da wastes. They driven fast. Getting bumped and tossed all over da place before they gets there. Finley pull up to a scrap eat the umis verb and I didn't. Da boys all pile out a da truck ta get stuck in. They got a plan. They all charge and yell and warag no umis though. One of da boys has a bad feeling about this. Then da ground starts moving and scrap starts fallin. Bunch of umis pop right out a da sand with stab us. Sneaky gets had sheets on top of him. They weren't very purple. Dunno how they was that sneaky. Ugly bugus. Some is all mutey and da rest is covered in rags with scrap. Da boys all yell and get stuck in. Thud hangs back and is shooting with a pair of da shooter boys. 
thud is hit and more gets den both of them combined. Prolly helps Datty aims. Buncher gets come out a da scrap heap with lasguns. Shooting at da boys. One a da shooters loses his head. Nob is real mad now. Start smashing da gets real good. Umi's flying everywhere. Thud is picking off da gets up on da heaps. Boys all think he has a jid finder or something to be shooting like that. Thud don't need no jid finder. But he thinks he is shooting just a little bit better than usual after they mention it. Last of da choppy yumis get crumped and da ones on da heap leg it. Lost two orcs. Crumped about a dozen umis cause they ain't as tough. Servivan boys all cheer and get to looting. Thud is last in line on da loot train. All he gets is some last guns and umi clothes that da boys don't want and da shooters kit. Immediately. Immediately. Immi. Right quick he bolts da shooter to his other one. Twin link now cuss orcs. Get some flak arm off one of da dead boys. Rips off da sleeves. New helmet with some numbers on it. Scrapes da numbers off and writes orc. Da boys get back ta town. Nob got a little bigger. More boys are not a sin. Er I am going to da get their kit snazzed up. Mech won't let fud in da shop. He ain't doing no work for some zoggin digger. One of da shooters says he's sorry. Da mech is a little old fashioned ya yeah, no. Thud says I'll get and goes ta grot alley instead. Whole place is a shitter. All da grots live in this little shanty town. Thud finds a spanner's shop and goes in. Sees a grot behind da counter. Slams da laskins on da counter with some teeth. Says he wants something made out of it by da and da day. Grot gulps. SS shorting boss. Thud is satisfied. Goes off ta find a place ta sleep. Nob lets em sleep in da back of da truck in da motor pool. Mostly just wanted Anna for guard. So Thud and two boys are sleeping in da truck bed when something makes a lil noise. Thud wakes up and sees some dozen grots with knives climbing into da truck. And a snot is trying ta steal one of his nice new, itch, boots. Ask Thud if he wants ta wake up da other boys. Zog that. Kicks da snot. Stands up and screams while Argazi starts firing point blank. Crits every shot. Turns da back o da truck into a blender. Da grots break and make a leg fair it. Thud goes out o da back and keeps shooting keeps screaming. Da other boys are both up and fumbling around. Ask what in mork is going on. Thud turns around. Knee deep in dead grots with a smokin shooter in his hand. Grots. Oh I got him. Gathers teeth before pushing da bodies out and going back to our sleep. Next morning he goes back to da grot shop. His beautiful new shooter is on da counter. Takes a closer look. The grot nailed all six of da LAS's todger for amused string so yapple all da triggers at once. Some of the nails are going through the barrels. Oh I. What in gawk is this? Is da shooter ya yeah asked fair boss. You call yourself a spanner. Nap. This yowza's shop. Nap. Where's da spanner? Unda the floorboards? Oh. What are you? Imar cook. Yells with me now. A white boss. Thud as his first new white buddy. Names I'm cookie. Gives I'm his old vest and cap with some shades. Gives I'm da newly named grotless Gatlin. Shoots six times around with a stun in strength two with no armor penetratin. Can't move and shoot. If he rolls a one he's got a roll to see if it goes kablooey. Goes through grots like a lawnmower. Can drop boys through sheer levels of dacker and luck. Thud and his new grot sidekick set off ta conquer mech town and get themselves some tickets ta get off this squig hull of a planet. Everything goes to zog pretty much instantly. That's all for that session. The next one will take some time to recollect all of the old notes and the map since it involved over 100 units. Including the brave story of the human who fought off 10 orcs in hand to hand combat for 7 rounds straight due to hilariously bad rolls. For those who are unfamiliar with the system, that's 20-30 attacks per round. Be me. DM mine another round of Gorkamorka. Two friends joined and due to the tales of infinite stupidity of the last few sessions. Finally have a party of reasonable size. Metal Ed. Span a boy with a truck who wants to be the best mech in town one day with his plucky assistant Rigger Grotty Tot. Grot Lord. Run for the that trusts his grots far too much. As such he has four with grotsikas loaded with small rockets. For giggles every rocket base weapon in the game got homebrew to scatter on a miss. The following is a good example of why this should never always be done. Thud gets woken up in the usual manner. 
Butar the head. Nob says he's rounding up da boys fair arrayed. Found where dem muties had their big camp. They been shooting all da scrappers that have been through da skid and it's getting right annoying gonna go clear em out. Thud wants ta know how many dare is. Dunno. What kit they got? Dunno. Does we know where they is maybes? Thud likes this preparation. Get da boys all rounded up. Thud meets da rest of da party. They got grots. He likes em. Party is void sighted target going grots all agree they gonna die. Da knobs wild party stops mucking about and rolls out. Got da battle wagon. A couple war buggies. A metal eads truck. Got 20 yard slugger boys and 10 shooters all piled on da wagon. Da party is all packed into da truck. All three of da idiots are in da cab. Da grots are all in da back. Driven fair a while. Finally see a big camp in da distance. Can make out a giant water tower, a fuel depot, a bunker, and a few big huts. Erion goes wire gonna floors it. Crank up da thrusters. Somehow none of them explode. They get in shooting range and a rocket comes screaming out a da camp. Zogs a buggy before they even get a chance da shoot. Erion L starts shooting everywhere. Ben knocks. They miss everything. Grotsikas fly off into nowhere. Umi is fire. Asked to be at least 30 of them. Couple o shooters who didn't keep their heads down lose em. Nob gets right pissed that day is scratching his paint. Boys shoot back gain. Close enough to hit stuff now. Thud gets a sniper out of da tower. Da boys get a couple off da topo da depo. Grots all aim at da tower and miss. One flies off to da side and hits some umis hidden behind a truck. Umis push a few broken trucks into da way to make a wall. Wagon ain't havin none o that. Smashes through and into da fuel building. Walls stop it after it gets to da gas. Metal doesn't wanna look bad. Crashes into da tower to impress da boss. Doesn't even shake it. Ruins da truck though. Bug is doing laps around da camp shooting everywhere. All da boys jump out and start charging getting shot to zog. Every armor keeps most a right. Dozens of umis with choppers come out of da buildings. Big ol' scrum and da streets. Metalhead gets out his burner and roasts da ones coming out of da tower. Thud as avian sniper fights with da ones across da street. Grotlord is trying to keep his herd from blowing up da party. Zaps an umi with his grot prod who didn't see I'm. Grot circus can't miss da tower now. All fire point blank into the side. Huge hole in it now. Da umis on top keep shooting. Decide that shooting da tower they are next to ain't a good idea. Da street is a right mess. Daka going everywhere and Arion is crumping Arion else. Nob climbs onto da wagon and jumps on top of da depot. Five shooty umis about to wave a bad time. Boys are a scream and turn. Dozen more umis on bikes with stabbers come roaring down da street. Buggy gets too close to one. Finds out them ain't normal stabbers. Party decides to stay off da street. Keep shooting everywhere. Thud steals a big shooter off a dead orc. Soon as he picks it up a pack of umis come round da corner. Thud smiles at Cookie. Cookie smiles back and spins up da grot gatlin. Close range bonos. These umis had a bad time too. Grot lord was too busy smashing an umi with his grot brood. Forget ta give da had new orders. Grots shoot at da building next to da tower. Half miss. Scatter into da tower. Party is a really loud creaking noise. Da fighting on da street stops and they all turn. Oh zog. Tower crashes right in da middle of da street. Crumps da build in cross from it and Arion and da way. All da remaining lancers crash into it. Everything is real quiet and dust everywhere. Then da ground shakes. Wairairag. Nobbin about a dozen of his hard boys come screaming out of da dust and charge da bunker. Party cheers and climb onto the wreckage. Start shooting at da umis on da only other in left. Grot suckers scatter and everywhere still. Get a couple umis but one zog's a boy too. Bunker starts red lasers into da boys. Thud sees a bunch of glowing red dyes inside. Lasers punch through da heavy armor. About 6 boys drop before they reach it. Boys jump in and kill 4 on da charge. Only one left. Thud gets a closer look. Umi with black armor and glowing red goggles. Got a real killy last gun with a backpack. Umi is fighting off 10 orcs and a knob with a bayonet. Going up against 30 attacks a turn. Apparently this Umi felt like Ben a badass today. 
At turn 1 he stabs a boy in da neck. Turn 2 he does it again. At turn 3 da rest of da umis get da kid, disen keeps going. At turn 4 he wounds da boss. At turn 5 he loses his helmet and beats a boy to death with it. At turn 6 da grots panic and shoot da bunker. Stuns a iron inside. Still kills an oath. On turn 7 he finally falls to da boss's big chopper. Umi is laying on da ground down. Boss gets down on me. Pats I'm a chopper and tells I'm he's da bestest Umi he's ever at our honor of crumping. Gives da nob one manly nod and goes tarby with gork and mork. Party buries dis Umi after thud takes all his kit. Party goes back home. Only da nob. Six sluggers. And da dipstick brigade made it back. Thud is led in da group in what would become a new hit around camp. Da boys is back in town with metal edge red in a guitar made of engine parts. Thud's got a lot of new flash and armor. Cookie has da flak jacket now. Carapace armor. With da sleeves torn off. Hotshot LAS. And a big shooter. Got a whole lot of teeth and some actual respect now. Da boys all go to da bar ta drink. Metal Ed and Grot Lord say dare you buys and ride off into da distance. Too busy ta join another round. Thud and Cookie go to the counter. Have a seat. And plan their next adventure. That's all for that session. Orcs lost 24 boys while the mutants and humans lost about 60. The unstoppable stormtrooper was not modified in any way from the usual, just a regular human with carapace armor. Mathematically should have been taking 4.95 wounds around on average. One would kill him, while dealing 0.05 wounds. Thud made it his mission in life to be as dead orky as that man was decided to tone down the big battles a bit. As epic as it was it made it kinda hard to focus on the players when they are just trying not to get caught in the hell storm of bullets. Next few sessions are a lot more detailed and focus more on Thud and his chronic stupidity. Next session Thud finally met his rival who was supposed to join his squad. Hired a mini boss he was supposed to kill. Gets a squad of morons to call his own and finally acquired his own truck which was lovingly named Da Short Bus. So I've recently moved Nick Bedia merch over to Teesprings and have a few new designs. Listings are below the video and in the description. Just stop! Just stop it! Stop! No! Just stop it! It's time to stop! It's time to stop, okay? No more! Where the fuck are your parents? Who are your parents? I'm gonna call Child Protective Services. It's time to stop!